Hey guys, welcome back from your Easter holidays. I hope you had an awesome Easter holiday with your family. It's Crypto Rocco here and today we're doing another video on Tron and Tron's testnet release. So today I'm going to tell you everything that you need to know about Tron. There are some FUD and inaccurate news going on. So I'll try to talk about the truth and accurate information about Tron. So the price of Tron has been going crazy really. It's gone up now because the whole market's recovering. But the price of Tron has been quite mad the past few weeks and before i get into this video guys i'd just like to say thank you to all my fans and followers and subscribers to my channel i've only been doing these videos for a couple of weeks and i've already got almost a thousand subscribers i was doing a video a week a day in the past week i had some time off work um and literally guys i want to thank you guys all for subscribing to my channel this is not even a part-time job for me i spent a lot of time because i really enjoy it and passionate about talking accurate truth true information because there's a lot of misinformation in this market so that's why i do this video and i really appreciate your help this support makes me want to do more videos and give you more value so if you guys enjoy this channel and enjoy videos like price predictions news updates technical analysis icos the whole lot of cryptocurrency world then please subscribe to my channel i'll bring you the most uh, best content in cryptocurrency and also guys i'm doing a, a litecoin giveaway to thank you guys for uh, subscribing to my channel and supporting me i'll be doing a litecoin giveaway once i hit my thousand subscribers so if you want to be in with a chance with that just subscribe to my channel like the videos that i make and also leave your comment leave comments below with your litecoin address not your bitcoin address your litecoin address and you will win some litecoins when i reach my thousand subscribers which i'm hoping should be within a week or so so thank you very much guys um right let's get into the video internet we want so today i'm talking about tron this is the justin nets launch he talked about this he did the online seminar he, to launch this event, which I quite liked, and I think you should watch it. Right, this is the bit I wanted to show you guys. So, on the big picture, I think our um, vision is decentralized web. So we have like a much more bigger picture than the Ethereum and the Bitcoin. Because first of all, this is a massive claim, by the way. <laughs> when I get to know the Bitcoin, um, Bitcoin is just like a, a P2P money. So Ethereum is more like uh p2p um blockchain the application platform but the trump for ourselves we um have much more bigger picture uh than just become a bitcoin or become a next ethereum next bitcoin uh we have a bigger picture to decentralize the web to make the web um, become the year um it was so basically, as you know, when the web was invented by Tim Berners-Lee, he wants the web and the internet to be decentralized. Um, so uh, we will uh, try to uh, make this mission accomplished. So yeah, that's what he had to say. Again, this has been massive news, the testnet launch. Every media outlet, everyone in cryptocurrency have been talking about it. It just shows how big cryptocurrency is. Again, I want to talk more about the technology and the news that's come out, but I'll talk about the price as well. The prices went down and then went up. And the main reason is I've always talked about this, guys. I, I've told my followers and subscribers and even send out trading signals on my Twitter and Instagram tell guys to take profit around this time because everyone buys the rumors and sells the news even if the testnet launch was massive people would still take profit and price would go down so i recommended that to all my subscribers again it just shows you you know when the social media um is talking about tron the price goes up and then it goes down it follows the social media and again it Justin Sun, that guy that I showed you, he's some some of it I really like because he's very good at promoting himself, but some of it can come across a bit professional and and could have a negative impact in impact on the Tron community. People might think he's a bit of a hype coin, but I I I, I quite like it. But I can understand both sides of the stories. Just saying that Tron uh, volume is massive, um, and it talks about the testnet launch. There's more articles about it. The testnet launch again, uh, what I talked about about the 75% price increase by the rumors, and then it crashed like 10 20%. Sell the news. They also covered uh, the decentralized uh, webinar for, for Justin. 
So, um, what do you need to know about Tron? I'll, before I get into this video, if you don't know too much about Tron, this is something that they released on their Twitter account. It talks about Tron is dedicated to building the infrastructure, truly decentralized internet, and build like an ecosystem for D apps, for entertainment, and all that. So, I, I'd recommend you look into Tron. And it's quite an early stage, so they're still developing their vision. Like he said, they've got a massive vision. So, you're literally. Um, investing in Justin and Tron you're not actually investing in the technology or a company you're in, in, investing in the team to deliver so it's important to look at the team and understand about the team which is what I always recommend the so key moments again testnet launch this is going to be massive mainnet launch they pulled it forward which is a good sign they're actually delivering some of the tech specs for the uh, technical guys to get into the technical team is very good experience of Alibaba Amazon Google uh, so it's big big news the community is massive one of the big biggest in the uh, cryptocurrency market which is you know it's great really if they can deliver guys they can drive adoption this is something that surprised me 100 million 100 million plus tron d app users I, I wasn't expecting that again don't need to say that that is brilliant news again the value global and token circulating volume trading volume is still not all the exchanges again these are price related i'm not more interested in technology but again we all like money don't we we might want blockchain to revolutionize the world but i think most people on here on some of my subscribers are probably only want to make money um rule tron take overtake ether so this is one of the big claims that justin sun was making so i wanted to show you this Justin Sun was talking about taking over, uh, going attacking Ether quite a lot. It was talking about um, prices. Uh, have I got? I want to show you another article. Sorry, I'll, maybe I haven't got that. But yeah, this is kind of the summary of the of the uh, the the interview, the the testnet launch video that he released on Periscope and Twitter. So I'm going to take you through the summary so you guys are aware. He attacked. Ether quite a lot. He was saying uh, it's a lot. It's a long way away. He he said that, and you you watch this small snippet. But he talked about um he talked compared it with Ether a lot. He talked about the scaling solutions. He said they'll grow larger than Ether, and then he talked about the the uh, transaction fees, transaction times. So if they can deliver on that, guys, on the new main on the main net in May, guys, this could be massive for Tron. Uh, we will launch an ETH airdrop again. This has been some some scams going on because people are talking about. Um, a uh, fake <laughs> Ethereum uh, stuff. So you need to make sure that you, you're you're careful. But yeah, this is quite good news as well. And um, we will migrate from Ether to Tron Network. It's the main net launch, guys. Which I said, this is their vision to build their own uh, blockchain, own own ecosystem. They can deliver that. That will be great. We will convince apps to move into Tron. So Pete, for other companies to build apps on Tron, this would be massive, guys, if they can do it. Because this, if they can deliver this, guys, this gives value to the Tron uh, token, which is brilliant, guys. And with their marketing and the community, I believe they'll be able to do it, you guys. And and also their product needs to be good. You can have all the supporters, all the people, but if, if your product's not good, people are not going to adopt it. So they need to deliver on their product on mainnet. Uh, we will have detailed plan for the migration by mid-April. I'm waiting for that because it's just two weeks away and I'm really looking forward to that. And I'll also recommend their technical team also did a video after Justin in the Justin Sun. I recommend you guys watch that as well. It goes in, into a bit more detail. We have much larger POS proof of stake. Yes, there will be proof of stake. However, details are not exactly clear. Um, Ethereum is planning to go into proof of stake. I mean, EOS are doing their own stuff. So if they if um, Tron can deliver POS uh, proof of stake um, and, and all that in a new uh, ecosystem, a new blockchain, in a, in a new platform, that could be massive for Tron. I've still got my concerns and I had massive doubts on Tron. I'm starting to believe a bit more in Tron since I've been part of the community and message from the Twitter guys. So this is good. Smart contracts, they're saying that their smart contracts would be better. Future smart contracts, um, zero transaction fee versus Ethereum. Again, they're trying to compete with Ethereum, which is big, big comp 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 competition. It's like David and Goliath because Ethereum is so massive. We will have consistent coin burn. I will come back to this, guys, because this has caused some massive negative news and FUD around it. Uh, we will use Java language. Java is very popular, so that's what they use. We have 100 million mobile users. I was surprised with this, guys, but again, if they have got that, this, this is brilliant, guys. I haven't 
looked at the credibility of the data, but a lot, lot of the people and but people just seems to just quote different things. I haven't done my credibility check, uh, my own due due diligence to confirm to much YouTube subscribers whether it's correct or not. But that's what they're c claiming. We will be devoted to our community support with one billion dollars. Wow. This is brilliant, guys. I, I, I think he will do it because he's so much into his social media. You can get rewards by running the node of Tron protocol elected by the community. This would help adopt because I said to you that they need to, people to be building apps on their platform. So this is something that will help. Both of these would help. A lot of the things he's trying to do would help. So I can see where where he's going. In, in conclusion, guys, I think his, his conclusion would be similar to mine, guys, where if they can deliver, it could be great. And it looks well planned. he done it on time, not like Verge. I've got loads of dislikes on my Verge comment on my video where I talked about whether it's a scam or not. So this video, guys, it Tron delivered on time, which is something I like and it's a lot more professional. Um, it talks about Ethereum still enjoys a huge network it's massive ambition so uh, that said if tron walks walks it it talks like walks the walk and uh, you can talk the talk but you need to walk the walk as well if they do that guys they've got it's deliver on the tech technology side to feed this community exactly what i've been saying guys so this is just an overview guys i'd recommend you watch the video but that is the main gist of what happened um, and the FUD, I'll talk about the FUD, guys. And this is this is the website that I've got the information from. They've got a summary of the Tron protocol, guys. And I'm not going to go into detail, but it talks about uh, in detail a bit more about the technology. If you want that information, guys, I recommend you watch it. I assume most of my subscribers are not too interested in that, but they're they're also looking at you know the high performance Tron protocol, token distribution, and Tron wallet. Those are going to be the main features. So those are the main features for the test net. I look at I look at a few more articles, guys. So the FUD, let let's the let the FUD begins. Zero chance of coming back. I'm not too sure, guys. This is uh, I'm not, I don't really agree with that. Tron gets so much negative uh, uh, negative news and negative FUD fear and you know uncertainty. It's just I'm I'm not too happy about this really. At, at the live launch, Tron Justin Sun and M emphasized that what he really cared about the future of the project not the price of the native coin so this guy's talking about whether tron's price can recover i mean i know it's gone up massively but i've talked about this guys the price went up because of all the fud that's why the price went up massively and we know why it went down it went down because sell buy the rumor sell the news that's what happened do i think it will come back yes i think it will come back if they can deliver it guys long term it should be great we saw where it went up i actually <laughs> i actually got into the foam and lost money there but I've, I've made a lot of money back during this this pump so that was good but yeah i mean i, I don't really i, I don't <clears throat> i don't particularly agree with the article but again i like to talk about both sides of the stories on my channel so i'm talking about the negative side as well so what, what it talks about the coin coin burn i think this was the biggest issue because people were cuz tron have got a massive uh, uh, tron's circulating supply is massive it's one of the biggest uh, in the top top 10 i believe i mean ripple's got a lot as well but they've got a massive total supply so they need to do some coin burn that's what that's what he was um justin sun talked about but he didn't go into too much detail so people were thinking that if they give thousand tron if they have thousand tron that thousand tron will turn into one tron that is not the case guys i'm not spread do you know what i mean guys that is not the case tell your friends post on facebook and twitter or share this video um that tron total supply is not if you have one tron it won't go to one that that is not what he said so let's just let's just clear that fud around so what next for uh, tron holders a bit rash to think testnet again no one thought testnet would uh, increase the value this is just a cryptocurrency market we, we buy the news you know we buy the rumors we're thinking about pumping so i knew this was going to happen main net launch i agree i think it will go up a bit more but if main net launch delivers over time it would see a massive increase if they can deliver on d apps let people build um, apps on the network guys it will be massive so i don't particularly agree with this coin burn guys let me uh, let me get rid of that again so tr tron you won't be losing if you have a thousand tron you won't end up having one tron what will happen is if people the coin burn how it will work is it's a bit confusing but from my understanding if you if you want to open an app on tron uh, you will have to give a thousand tron 
uh, to open that and those thousand tron will get burned so oh, if you if there's like a thousand if there's like a hundred hundred people a uh, hundred apps being open uh, uh, if you think about it, ethereum's got thousands of apps so if, if there's ethereum's got thousands of people building on their platform if if tron can get thousand people to build on their network on their blockchain on their platform a thousand a hundred thousand tron would get burned if they can get 100 apps so that is what's going to happen few people have said for each token that you release you have to burn a tron i don't think that's the case because then you'll be burning it will be really expensive to to uh come on release apps on tron and uh, tron would try to drop the barrier as low as possible to get people to come and launch on their app so about a thousand um they'll burn as long when you open an app um, on their network you'll have to burn a, a thousand which is good which is not too high not too less but it, it reduces the supply in the long term which will increase the value of tron in theory at least so a few other articles are talking about the success. So it, there was a big launch. There was a massive, again, I'm not sure if you follow him on Twitter. I'm quite big on Twitter, guys. I released a lot of information on there. It talked about it um, on the NASDAQ. So they released it on there, which is which is massive news. NASDAQ screen in Times Square. Um, and few people have told that it was a good launch. I, I, I think it was successful. Uh, pr 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 price levels remain in question. I've talked about it, guys, what what was going to happen with the price in my pri previous video. And it wasn't that hard to predict. A lot of the amateur, I'm not saying I'm an expert, I know it all, I always get it right. But few people have said that this was going to be the case. Justin Son, test not, a tense test net launch on time. This is brilliant, guys, for credibility and being professional. And so I'm going to make a video about Justin Sun and Tron community and about the kind of the fad and scam and the negative kind of um, view on tron community in the future because i don't really like it in the cryptocurrency but you know justin sun can do what he does best if you can deliver on the technology on your promises on your deadlines people are going to start to start to take you seriously there's going to be fad negative view on tron but if they can successfully release the main net and p if they can get people to come in and work with tron guys this could be something huge for tron it's going to be like donald trump says huge so yes guys this can be it would be it would be massive guys again on twitter guys follow tron um foundation they are quite vocal on it the way they did it um and they're, they're very, um, they communicate a lot with the community, which is very good because they keep us aware of what's going on. It's fairly easy to follow. Some of the companies, guys, they don't really talk as much or don't, don't communicate the right things. With Justin, I know he's a bit flashy and it can cause a negative effect on, on, on the Tron community because sometimes he's young and f flashy and not maybe not as professional. But I... I'll talk about it in another video, but he has done well to keep us up to date with what's been going on. And this is another good news, guys. 126 node in five countries, in, con in five continents. I I, I tweeted, tweeted this as well because it just shows you uh, how big Tron can be if they can, if they can start delivering, guys. So, yes, this could be massive news for Tron. And um, finally, guys, I think this is the last article. I'd look, it just talked about Tron losing 70, 17% in value. And we know why. If you're watching my videos, guys, we know why it was going to happen. There's going to be corrections. The market is recovering. So it's gone up slightly in the past uh, in the past day because the whole market is recovering. But in the future, guys, I'd say it would probably grow. If, if the market grows, Bitcoin grows, I think it will start growing, going up and up. And then people might start take profit again buy the rumor sell the news but again do not this is not investment advice this is my advice i'm not sure if i'll buy more tron I'm, i've got a few more other coins that i'm looking at and um, i've already got decent amount of tron so i'm not sure if i'll buy more but it, it's up to you guys whether you guys would like to buy more or not but my prediction would be probably move with the market or move slightly high up uh, with the news for uh, main net launch on end of may 31st of may i believe but after that, guys, I think it might, if, if, if the mainnet launch is successful, it will people will still take a bit of profit because it should go up like this. Um, but if it if it fails, then I'm not saying it will. If it does, it could crash massively. But if it is successful, people will take a bit of profit, then go up again. And in the long run, guys, I'm really hopeful with Tron. The community is great. I've messaged with some of the developers and, and people, senior people that know about Tron. And I'm quite hopeful on Tron. And it went up to 10. It's, it's, it's 
dropped back down to 14 with you know by the rumors and sell the news after the launch but overall it's in a healthy state so that is the video guys i've talked about I give you guys an overall view on what's been going on. I hope you guys have enjoyed it, guys. This is a bit longer video, but it had to be long to give you all the information. But I'll do another Tron video, guys, where I talk about the community and what I'd like from the community a bit more, and I'd like to get your feedback on it. But in this video, I'll give you guys an overview of what's going on with Tron, testnet launch, and what will happen in the future. What do you think about it, guys? Do you think the price will go up in the long run? Do you support Tron? What are your thoughts on the community? Do you think they'll deliver it, the main net launch? Um, I'd love to hear your thoughts, guys. So leave your comments below. And like I've said before, guys, I'll be doing a Litecoin giveaway once I reach my 1,000 subscribers in a week or so. So please leave your Litecoin address below. And I will see you guys soon with another great video. And finally, guys, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, share this video with your friends, family, and I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much.